One of the classic things you'll hear us saying on an academy course is you're skiing in an A-frame or an asymmetrical stance. It's really, really common in skiing. You've only got to go and video indoor snow dome or a pitch of a busy part of the piste. 30 seconds on your phone, look back to footage, you'll see most skiers skin in A-frame. What it basically means is either your knees are closer together than your feet or your feet are wider apart than your knees. Either way, it's asymmetric. If you're trying to ski like that, imagine trying to make two edges rail and track with each other. It's not gonna work very well for you. And it really shows like the acid test is in powder when you've got skis at slightly different angles, they do go in different directions. What we're gonna do is give you a few pointers that'll help you work out how to become a symmetrical skier. A great thing to think about for symmetry is an equipment check. An equipment check is really simple but essential before you get going. You could do all the best things in the world, but if your equipment down there, at your boots and your skis isn't set up correctly, it's a waste of time. So make sure your boot uh, alignment has been set. Someone has had a good look at your leg alignment. I know myself personally, I've got a right leg that bows out. I have to get that specially adjusted. And your footbeds, your footbeds are essential to get them made, contoured to your foot and stabilizing you for lateral movements. Something to really help symmetry is skiing with your hands on your knees. Quite often, your head is up here and it almost feels like a visual block as to what is going down at your knees. You can usually only do it with video analysis if someone's filming you. But if you haven't got that luxury, Get your hands on your knees. Um, think about getting yourself set up in a, a symmetrical stance like this and ski from turn to turn with a little bit of force guiding your knees. First of all, the hands are a great sensitivity guide. They'll, they'll, they'll make you feel your, your legs and your knees where they're at. But if there is an issue or a correction that needs to take place, the hands can slowly assist, give that little bit of a gentle encouragement to try to help you end up with a perfectly symmetrical stance. As we talked about before, Hands on knees, great way to stabilize your symmetry and get that working for you. Just gonna get the, the feeling here as I roll into the turn, making sure the hands are helping me with the symmetry in the knees. Making sure they're helping the symmetry in the knees. Symmetry in the knees. 